Day in Macomb, Western Illinois hosted their mega reunion where alumni all the alumni of all classes made the trip back to the MAC for the WIU football game versus Illinois State. There was plenty of tailgating, catching up, and of course, good times we had throughout the day for one alum and Quincy native Brian Spots. He loves getting the chance to spend time with his former teammates. This weekend, actually, we, I've got uh, a reunion with, with 12 of my former teammates, and it's always great to see those guys. And we host every uh, football game. Uh, we just ask the alumni come back, and we provide all the food and all the beverages. Um, I, I'm, I, I bleed purple and gold. I'm a true leatherneck, that's for sure. It was also senior day at WIU. J.J. Ross, one of the many seniors being honored before the opening kickoff versus Illinois State. Western got off to a slow start. First play from scrimmage. Redbirds connect on a big play over the middle to give ISU great starting field position, but they were unable to capitalize. A couple possessions later, Redbirds continuing to roll on offense, but this time the big hit knocks the ball out, and Western's Braden Smith is able to jump on it to swap fields. Off the turnover, big third down coming up here for the next, but Matt Morrissey finds Donald McKinney over the middle to move the chains. And a couple plays later, Morrissey back in the spotlight, dropping back once more, and finds Taj Sanders wide open for the touchdown. However, that would not be enough. Your final from Hanson Field today. Leathernecks fall to the Redbirds, 34-18.